Tornado Facts for Kids One of the most severe weather events that can occur is a tornado. You'll learn in this video what exactly tornadoes are, where are tornadoes likely to occur, and how they form. How does a tornado form? Thunderstorms can produce tornadoes, however, a thunderstorm alone will not cause a tornado. They only occur when there is a shift in temperature, wind speed, or direction during a powerful thunderstorm. There is a chance that a tornado could emerge given these circumstances. Tornadoes are made up of really fast spinning tubes of air that eventually form into a funnel. The clouds in the sky above will be connected to the ground down below by this funnel. If you look up in the sky you may see a dark greenish tinge that covers the sky. This is caused by ice, called hail, which is forming inside the thunderstorm. Even though there have been reports of tornadoes in every state in the US, Tornado Alley is where many of them originate. Iowa, Kansas, South Dakota, Oklahoma, and Nebraska are all part of this region of the Midwest, which stretches from Texas to Ohio. These states are in the path of both cool air coming from the Rocky Mountains and warm, humid air coming from the Gulf of Mexico. Tornadoes are frequently created when the warm and cool airstreams collide. What time of year has the most tornadoes? Although storms can occur at any time of the year, Texas, Oklahoma, and Kansas experience tornado season from late May to early June. Tornadoes are more likely to form in June or July in North and South Dakota, Nebraska, Iowa, and Minnesota. Where do the most tornadoes occur? That would be Weld County in Colorado. This county lies just north of the Denver metro area and has tallied 262 tornadoes between 1950 and 2016, which is an average of roughly four tornadoes each year. How fast can a tornado's winds get? The enhanced Fujita scale is used to gauge tornado activity. The Fujita scale, which ranges from EF0 to EF5, rates the intensity of tornadoes. EF0 tornadoes are weak and, at worst, do little to no damage. EF5 tornadoes are said to be extremely destructive and capable of wreaking havoc. Sometimes they spin so fast that buildings, trees, and other objects can be broken apart and thrown around. The wind speed of F0 tornadoes can reach 65 miles per hour. That speed can seem to be very fast, and it is. However, an extremely powerful tornado will have wind speeds that can reach up to 300 miles per hour. Can a tornado occur over water? Yes, a tornado is referred to as a water spout when it occurs above water, such as the ocean. It is also possible for a tornado to originate over the water and then migrate to land. There are several different names for tornadoes. They can also be called cyclones, funnels, and twisters. The most violent tornadoes come from very powerful thunderstorms called supercells. These are large thunderstorms with winds already in rotation. About one in a thousand thunderstorms becomes a supercell, and one in five supercells creates a tornado. What can be done to help keep people safe? When your area is expecting severe weather, you should begin listening to the local weather stations so you can stay informed and safe. A good weather radio can also help alert you when it is the middle of the night. There are also many weather apps for your smartphone which can do the same. The first type of warning you may have in your area is called a tornado watch. This means that the weather conditions are such that a tornado can form. The second type is called a tornado warning. This means that either a tornado has been spotted on the ground by someone, such as a storm chaser or first responder, or by weather radar, also called Doppler that has indicated there definitely is rotation occurring within the storm itself. In general, storm chasing refers to the intentional chase of any extreme weather phenomena for news or media coverage, scientific research, adventure, or curiosity. Where is the safest place to be during a tornado warning? If you hear a siren during a thunderstorm, that means that there is a tornado warning. So, take shelter fast. The best places to ride out a tornado are cellars, basements, and other underground locations. Head to a room with no windows on the ground or first floor of your home or structure if you are unable to reach an underground refuge. Shelter in a bathroom or closet, and if you can, wrap up in a mattress, sleeping bag, or blanket. On March 18, 1925, the tornado that killed the most people ever struck. Because it happened in three different states, Missouri, Illinois, and Indiana, it is known as the Tri-State Tornado. The F5, the longest tornado ever, traveled 219 miles over these three states. So please take all severe weather alerts seriously and stay safe. I hope you enjoy our videos. 
If so, please hit the like button and also subscribe to our channel.